wait for a few more people to join. Oh, oh my gosh, there's already... I haven't been on live in quite a while. I believe the last time I went on Instagram live was in Hong Kong in like 2019. So it's literally been like years. Um, so hi everyone. Um, as most of you probably know, I am launching a new series today called Liza in Korea. And um, what makes it even more special is I'm actually in Korea right now. Um, and I'm just here to chat with you guys for a little bit. Hi, Tito Mickey. Yes, this is very rare. Um, yeah, I just wanted to do like a little countdown party with everyone before Liza in Korea comes out tonight at 8 p.m. in Manila, 9 p.m. here in Korea. So if you guys have any questions that you guys want to ask me before, let's chat. Hi, Gerard. Oh my gosh, there's so many of my friends here watching. It makes me nervous. Thank you guys for watching. Hi, Lysanians. Thank you guys for joining. Okay, wait. So I told myself I was going to eat while doing this live because that's what I see a lot of my favorite K-pop idols doing when they do lives. So right now I'm drinking this. This is my favorite drink. It's like a peach flavored water drink. I don't, I think it's called 2%. Oh, it has 65 calories. What is it 2% of? 2% peach? Okay, I'm gonna just start like answering some questions and talking to you guys. So, first up, I am Miss Ray M. Hi, I am Yash from India, please say hi. Hi, Yash from India, thank you so much for watching. So Jackie underscore 2124 just asked me, aren't you going to make a film? Um, yes, bo. Um, I'm currently in the middle of developing something right now. So please be patient. Thank you guys for waiting and for being so patient. I love you guys. Um, pa shout out po sa kaibigan ko, Jeb Del Rosario. Salamat. Hi, Jeb Del Rosario. Thank you for the love. Ooh, Luo Andre said St. Patrick's School of Kesson City. Yes, that's where I graduated from high school. Kimmy is asking, did I see Jenny? No, I did not see Jenny. I'm not in, um, I'm not in Seoul right now, actually. Am I in Seoul? I don't know where I'm at. I'm, I'm outside of Seoul right now. Um, what else? I'm so nervous. Everyone, there's so many people watching. <laughs> Okay, um, I also have this little cognac jelly peach drink that I'm going to take. Okay, does anyone have questions for me? I, I don't see a lot of questions. Uh, what's your favorite food while you're in Korea? Oh, okay, that's, that's a hard question to answer because there's so many things that I like. There's so many different dishes that I like. I would say my top three, I'll just give you my top three. Sundubu jjigae. Yukejang and um, like a barbecue, like Hanu beef or something. Um, oh, sorry. You are so beautiful. How are you, Liza? This question came from Walnut and the City. I am doing fine. Thank you very much. I'm just enjoying my time here in Korea and I'm really excited about to tell you guys all about the projects that I've been working on. Um, so yeah, thank you for asking. I, how are you guys? Which restaurant has the best K barbecue? That is kind of hard to answer. We just came from a place earlier. I don't know what the name of it is because it was like literally written in Hangul. Um, but it was like a barbecue place and we had the best like beef barbecue and it came with this rice that has like perilla leaves and raw beef which can be a little scary for some to try, but it was really, really good. Um, Forever.Yang said, cheer me up. I have many exams. Good luck with your exams. Um, I will be praying for you. One tip that I can give you, like this is what I used to do before. I would take an exam and I don't know if it really works, but like I would rewrite, um, I would make my own 
like review sheets, reviewers or something. And then I would always write it in blue ink. And for some reason, I felt like the blue helped me like clear my mind better and help me memorize things better. I also read that like, if you eat chocolate before an exam, like it can help you remember better. So that's what I used to do when I was back in high school. I, I genuinely just enjoyed eating chocolate before the exams, but who knows, it might help you. Oh my gosh, Salon de Lapin. This is my favorite salon to go to, uh, nail salon to go to when I'm in Korea. Oh, it means when you need 2% hydronic time, it's, oh, it fuels you, okay. So I'm, oh, these are both peach. I'm eating, two, eating and drinking two peach flavored snacks. Hi, Serena, done watching the Netflix Dolce Amore. Thank you so much, Pring Stana. Teddy posts PH, asked me if I'm in Careless Hub. No, I'm in Korea right now. Um, Lysanians, I miss you guys too. LQ Forever 24, I love you too. Um, what country is your favorite? My favorite country, um, I don't really have like a favorite country to like live in or go to. I, I'm really like a traveler, so I like exploring different countries from time to time. <laughs> have you seen Cha Un Wu? This came from M Yellow V. Um, no, I have never met Cha Un Wu. Sam Thing, oh eight, is Angel pretty in person? She's a goddess. Like, I've never seen a more beautiful person. Kapag napansin mo ko, re-reviewin ko buong book ng Anna Fee. Hi, ours underscore Manil. I hope you enjoy reading this book. Tone, Tony Evan Manila, any anecdotes about Pia? When you say Pia, is this Pia Wurtzbach? I love Pia Wurtzbach at the Pia Wurtzbach. She is such a genuine person, very kind, very funny, actually. I think that's what a lot of people, oh, well, I think a lot of people know that about her. We see that in her Instagram captions all the time, and I, I really appreciate that about her. She has a great personality, and she's beautiful. What would I say to my 17-year-old self? Just have fun. Work and have fun. Mm. Try 2% zero too, it's enjoyable. Thank you, I will try. I haven't seen the zero one yet, but I will keep that in mind. Chexy Jean, Jeannie, I'm so sorry. I don't know if I'm pronouncing these names right. Do I watch K-dramas? Yes, I do watch K-dramas. Not pretty, not that often anymore. I would say, because I've just been so busy like writing scripts and just working on my businesses. So the last K-drama that I think I watched was 2521 and I didn't even get to finish it. I think I'm down to my last three episodes. That one was actually a longer K-drama than most. Korean words you learn there. This is from Ryoj Kaito. Um, I learned this from my friend Angel and it's hangul chukum arayo. That means I can speak Korean a little, but that's a lie because I really can't. <laughs> do I like kimchi? This is from Josh underscore Wua. Yes, I do like kimchi, and I just discovered that I like fresh kimchi more than like the kimchi that's fermented for like weeks or months. Sorry, I don't know if they ferment it for months, but I I like the fresher one. Are you going to watch the finale of BP? This is from Joanne underscore 2579. I currently don't have any plans. I, I, I didn't know it was their finale. Oh yeah, I, I did hear that they're having a finale concert in Seoul, in Korea, but um, I don't know if I'm going to be here by that time. How many hours a day do you work on your latest project? This is from Andre Dagyan, da, oh, the giant, SXM, sorry, I'm, I'm butchering these names. Um, it depends, really. I, I would say that I work like five to six days a week. I just love working. I don't even consider it work, really. Um, and I usually start my days at like 9 a.m. and then I end at like 7, 8, almost 12 hours sometimes. But like I said again, 
work doesn't feel like work to me, so I'm happily just doing things. What's your favorite Korean expression or phrase? I learned a word yesterday. I was filming for Huiting and um, my friends, my well, I want to call them my friends. My friends taught me the word chisahe, which means like petty. Oh my gosh, Liza and Korea is out already. Sorry, I had so much fun talking to you guys. It's already 9.01 p.m. So <laughs> Liza and Korea is out, guys. I think, wait, should, should I just watch it on my laptop? Okay, I'm just going to watch it on my laptop with you guys. Um, if you guys have another device or not, please come with me and watch. I mean, don't come with me. How, how are you going to come with me? Just join. <laughs> Okay, wait, I think my laptop's dead. Never mind. So I, I'll talk to you guys for a bit more and then you guys can go ahead and watch Liza in Korea on YouTube on the link that I posted on my IG stories right after watching this live. What's the product of your lipstick so beautiful? Shoot, what is the name of the lipstick I'm using? Laka. Laka. It was given to me by my makeup artist in LA named Priscilla Pei. And um, I actually use this for the gold gala. And so I've just been using it. It's more like a lip tint, but it has like a bit of like a glossy sheen to it when you apply it. And then after a while it goes away and it just stains your lip. That was from Once Upon a Dream, by the way. Did you visit any Filipino communities there in Korea? This is from Jash the Baritone. Um, actually, no, I didn't know that there was actually a Filipino community here. If there is, please let me know about it and I would love to meet everyone here. Who is your favorite K-pop boy group? This is from Leia Lianyan. My favorite K-pop boy group, I feel like this is no surprise or secret. Um, it's BTS. I love BTS and I'm, I always say this, but... When I start liking a boy group, I usually just stick to one boy group. But I do listen to a lot of K-pop music in general. So I do I do like a lot of different um, K-pop boy group songs. But um, like I'm not like an avid diehard fan of any of the groups. I also really just don't have time to like um, really invest in like learning about them and everything right now. As opposed to like when I had time to really look into BTS. Okay, say hi Indonesia please. Hi everyone from Indonesia that's watch watching right now. Thank you so much for tuning in and I love you guys. Fave K street food and shout out Nadin. My favorite K street food would have to be, um, I think udeng. I tried it um, actually during Liza in Korea and it was very yummy. Um, I also like, Shoot, I'm forgetting the name of it. Um, it's like the, the fruit on a stick that's covered in sugar. So I really like that. Um, I'm not Alyssa underscore. Cheer me up, please. I'm still applying for a job here in Manila. Alyssa, you can do this. I believe in you. God bless you. And don't give up. Love you. Who's your yellow? What does that mean? Sorry, I'm, I'm genuinely confused. I don't know what who's your yellow means. <laughs> oh, same with blue ink. See, I'm not the only one that thinks that. Lysanians is asking if I can do egg yolk. I don't know how to do egg yolk. And I feel like I would look funny doing it. The Koreans do it so well, but like, I don't know, maybe I can just do different types of hearts. How else? Oh, I have a broken finger, so my hearts don't look as perfect. That's another heart. This is another heart. This is another heart. And then there's like the hamburger heart. Oh, the, the hamburger heart that you like. And then it goes like that, right? <laughs> Something like that. From fro Fromises? The best thing about you is having a good heart. Oh, thank you so much. I love you. Ano po ini inom I'm drinking this 2% P 
peach water. I thought it meant it has like 2% peach, but apparently it's like a drink that gives you energy. Abby Jory, Joriel Robus, you look so happy now, so proud of you. I am so happy right now. Thank you so much. I'm really excited to share Liza in Korea with all of you, and I hope you guys will watch it after tuning into this live. Starboy just said, I am excited about the clothing brand that you are currently working on right now. Thank you so much. Actually, they just... Um, launched the brand today and I am their brand ambassador and I'm really, really very excited about it. So I hope you guys can follow the page too. I'll post about it actually in my story so that you guys can follow. It's called La Cimer and um, it's a brand here. It's a new brand that they're making here in Seoul, but it is created by one of the biggest um, fashion companies here in Seoul. Thank you for being excited too. Oh shoot, I keep accidentally pressing things. When are you going home, babe? This is by Erin Jetro. Um, I'm going home. Actually, I feel like that's a trick question. I'm going home soon. I feel like, wait, I feel like all these questions were, oh my gosh. Okay, if I scroll all the way down, there's so much more questions. <laughs> sorry, I don't know how this thing works. I am so sorry. How many piercings do you have? Ooh, I was so, I'm so excited for people to ask me that. Okay, so I, ooh, it's a little infected, so please don't judge, but I have one, two, three, four, five, six. I actually used to have more. I had two right here. I had two right here. I had three right here, but because I had surgery for my finger multiple times, I kept on having to take out the piercings before they were even fully healed. And so after the surgery, I would wake up and they, they were closed already. But yeah, I have a lot of piercings. Just those though. Liza, help na kita nabatiin lahat. <laughs> this is from Brando Bandido. I'm so sorry. I'm just taking my time trying to talk to each and every one of you, but there's so many of you guys. I appreciate you so much. Anong pong favorite pancit canton flavor niyo from Core with Butter? Ooh, I love the spicy one. Just the spicy one. And the spicy calamansi one. And I love add, adding like a itlog asado. Asado itlog. Uh, no, is that the right word? The the egg that's not like fully cooked. Yung medyo liquidy pa yung, yung yolk. Can you please congratulate my girl? She graduated cum laude. Better Lee Garcia. Hi, Better Lee Garcia. Congratulations. Wow, cum laude pa. I hope you... Um, I hope you reach all of your goals and dreams in the near future and I will be praying for your success. Ah, oh, sorry. This is so hard. There's so many questions coming in all at once. Um, Malasadong itlog. Thank you, Tutsi Wutsi. Yes, malasadong, not asadong, malasadong itlog. Asado is a shopao. Shopao, asadong, shopao, shopao asado. <laughs> my Tagalog, my Tagalog is getting bad. I need to take a course on it again. Hi, please say hi to Malaysia fans. Hello to all my Malaysia fans watching right now. Thank you so much for being here tonight. I appreciate all of you guys and I hope to visit Malaysia one day. I've actually met a few Malaysian fans um, on my recent trips and I got to say you guys are very lovely people. No make. What's no make mean? No makeup? Na mismo ba sinangag nun italiana ka pa? Sorry, that question did not make sense to me. Na mismo ba sinangag nung Italiana ka pa? I was never an Italian. I'm American and Filipino. And sinangag. I'm, I'm, I don't really, I'm not a fan of sinangag. So, <laughs> not really. Kailan upload niyo po ulit ng vlog? Oh my gosh, I can't believe you guys. Okay. I can't believe there's a lot of people that still watch my vlogs. Thank you guys so much. Um, I don't know. I'm I, I'm coming out with the Liza and Korea vlogs, but they're not on my personal channel. It's on the Puhaha channel. And Puhaha means it's like a big laugh. 
in Korean. So please check out Liza in Korea. As for my own personal vlogs dropping on my personal channel, um, just stay tuned, please. I, I can't really say when I'll be posting a new vlog. Um, yeah, so Dolce Amore, I played an Italian character. But the Sinagog, maybe she meant Sinigang. I love Sinigang. And yes, I did miss Sinigang when I was in it Italy. Pupunta ka ba sa anniversary ng I Am Worldwide? This is from Kat Kat. Yes, yes, I am going to the anniversary of I Am Worldwide next month. And I'm super excited about it. But I can't tell you guys why. So stay tuned. Advice how to focus on studies po at pa shoutout na din sana manotis po from vv underscore beanies. Um, how to focus on your studies. I would say you just have to put, you, you just have to like organize your time and really put in the effort to um, a lot time for that. Um, I would say like when back when I was still in high school and I was also working at the same time, it was really hard for me to manage doing everything at once, but I was very determined to finish high school. So kahit na sobrang busy ko, kahit na puyat ako sa kakataping, kahit nga there were times na natatapos ako sa taping ng 5 a.m., 6 a.m., dumidiretso talaga ako sa school because as much as possible, possible gusto ko talaga na ma ma makakapasok ako. Wait, I saw James Banaag ask me a question. Where did you go? Where are you, James Banaag? I missed it. Oh, I'm so sad. I saw it, but I missed it. Um, what brand? Uh, someone already asked me that. I'm using Laka. I'm not sure what country that's from, but it's called Laka. Paborito mo po sinangag sa simo. See, I even forgot about that. Oh yeah, I think Serena Marquesa loves cinema, but me personally, not a fan. Aaten ko po ba sa AAA sa Filipino Arena? Secret! Makita na lang tayo. Ako si Brid J. Liza, you lost a lot of weight. Nice, looking good. Mm, thank you for the compliment, but... I prefer when people don't talk about my weight, whether it is that I gained or lost weight. I just feel like it's not an appropriate thing to say to people. But thank you. Thank you for the compliment. Bakit wala ka sa preview? Hinahanap kita dun. EJ Nuas. Um, I was flying here to Korea, actually, on the day of the preview ball. I wanted to attend, but unfortunately, my schedule did not align. So hopefully next year. Sally Nader. Liza, I'm in love with this girl, so she doesn't like me back. Oh, how do you know she doesn't like you back? Did you, did you ask her? Did you tell her that you love her? Did you share your feelings? But if, if you did, then I guess you just have to accept it. I think when we love people, we can't, we can't force them to love us back and we can't get upset with them if, that's not the way they feel about us too. When we love people, we love people because we want to love them and not because we want them to love us back. We shouldn't expect anything in return. Hi, my BF Drew Yupo. If you want to see it, nasan ko na po Thank you so much to your boyfriend, A.E. Luna, for drawing me. I really appreciate it. And I really get so kilig when people use me as their inspiration for their art. Sandra A.29, pag ako napansin na to, for sure, sobrang inspired ko sa demonstration ko. Hi! Napansin na kita. Sana ma-inspire ka. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. What else? Hi, Stanley. I saw that you just joined. Stanley's the best. Favorite K-beauty trick you learned from Korea? This is from my girl, Kimmy. Hold on. By the way, this is not sponsored. I'm just, I, this is really my favorite trick. <laughs> um, but my favorite makeup trick that I learned while here in Korea, they're very, um, they pay a lot of um, attention and detail into your eyes. And so there's this one trick that they do with curl, because I love curling my lashes. They're not really curled right now because I do not, I haven't, sorry. I'm just like, 
Um, I haven't really learned how to do that trick yet, but here in Korea, what they like to do is they curl your eyelashes and then after they get two like sticks and they burn the stick with a lighter and then they curl your lashes again using the sticks. Like it, it's kind of burnt like charcoal and it helps your eyelashes stay curled for longer. Hi, Stanley. Aside from BTS Po, what group do you stand for? Po? This is from Lala, La La Lane. Um, there's a lot of girl groups that I stand. So I really love Blackpink. I love Itzy. I love Mama Moo. I love New Jeans, La Seraphim, G Idol. Right now, um, who else? I really love Chun Somi's music. Um, Momoland. Yeah, I'm just a girl. I'm a girl's girl. I love girls. I I, I love girl groups. <laughs> Why did I say that like that? But yeah, I love girls. I'm a girl's girl. I just know people are going to take that sound bite and be like, Liza loves girls. I do. I really do. Amami Me 17. I probably butchered that name again. Nagja jump rope kadin bapang naga exercise. No, I do not jump rope. I love, I used to really love jump rope when I was little. Um, but no, I don't do jump rope as much anymore. I actually don't like jumping that much just because it, it has a lot of impact on your knees. And I'm, to be honest, I'm not a cardio girly. I really hate cardio. The most cardio that I do is the Stairmaster. And every time I feel like giving up, I feel like dying. Um, but it's, it's, an, it's, it's a must. It's necessary. It's good for your heart. Hello, Hopi. Sanama Pansin Moho. Hello, LQ Forever 24. You're my bestie. We always talk to each other. I mean, you always talk to me on Instagram and I see your messages and I love you. Marlon Drift said, Your fellow celeb Alawi doesn't seem to notice my efforts. Aw. I'm sure she sees your messages because, just like me, we all like to read all the lovely messages our fans sent us. And it's just so hard to like respond to each and every one of you. And we also don't want to be unfair by responding to one person and not responding to everyone else. So when we can, katulad nito, like nasa live stream ako ngayon, I try to answer as many people as possible. And I'm sure she would love to respond and, and acknowledge your efforts too. So just keep trying. Tips on how to adjust in a new environment from Sel Sabagat. Um, I would say, number one, you just, you have to be able, you have to learn how to be able to adjust to other people. If you're going to a new country, you have to play by their rules. Get to know their culture, understand, um, understand their culture. It, it's also nice to learn a little bit of the language, I guess, so that when you go there, you know, you can respond. I think every, every country or every person from different country um, appreciates the small efforts of like us trying to learn their culture and their language a little bit. Are you by yourself right now? Angel NX10. I'm at an office right now, so there's a lot of people. So I'm not by myself, but in this room, I'm, I am alone. Um, how old are you, Nepo? This is from Definitely Not Lies. I am 25 years old. Hi, Atimaki. I miss you. Hi, Hopi from Asingan. This is Anariza Selga. Hello. I'm also from Asingan. Current favorite song. What's your ETA? What's your ETA? Mm -hmm. What's your ETA? That's my favorite. Um, and Vampire by Olivia Rodrigo. Bloodsucker fame. Mm -hmm. Bleeding me. Young Sub Lee. Hi, Liza. So that, the person that I just responded to is actually one of our amazing cameramen from Liza in Korea. So let's all give a round of applause to him. Thank you so much. And he's a new father. His wife gave birth during the filming of Liza in Korea. So congratulations again. That was a few months back, but... Still, congratulations. My favorite movie 
I can never give a proper answer for this, but I'm just gonna say Harry Potter, like all the Harry Potter movies. K-drama I'm currently watching. I'm currently not watching a K-drama actually, sadly. I should actually get back on my K-drama grind. I'm just so busy. Um, oh, it's 9.20. Oh wait, Sige, I'll answer five more questions before I go. And then please don't forget to watch Liza in Korea. Again, it's on my IG stories. You can click on the link in my IG stories and it will direct you to the Puhaha channel. Um, again, Liza in Korea is not on my personal channel, so just go to Puhaha's channel. Thank you. But, um, okay, so I'm going to answer five more questions and then we're all going to go watch, okay? Ooh, 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 ooh. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, Nicole Anello, Twice. Yes, I do love Twice. How could I have forgotten? I love Twice. Did you guys see Misamo's, um song i was obsessed with that i was obsessed with the i'm i'm a terrible dancer so i'm not even gonna try sorry favorite song of bts save me i'm really an og army <laughs> i'm an og army so i like their older songs the most um yeah Okay, how many did I answer already? That was one, right? That was one? Or did I do two already? Okay, let's just say that was one. My Koreano po basa Korea. Of course. Christine.Perez asked me, what role do you want to try for your next project? I want to try playing... I really want to be in like a dystopian movie or a zombie film or like I want to be an assassin. I really want to do something that's like really cool and more action-packed and a little darker so that's two um from z dot kids liza how are your interactions with the rose so um the rose they are my label mates we um are all, all under the same management company in la called transparent arts and they're like my older brothers um they're they're really nice. Um, they're really cool people to hang out with. They're a lot of fun. And um, yeah. That was three, right? Sorry, I'm so bad at keeping track of this. Um, I just, uh, do, do, do. Hello, um, who is this? Rhea Pauline, Ray, underscore Rhea Pauline. Yes, I am in Korea right now. And I've, I'm going to be here for a while. Um, favorite color, mopo. So before it was blue, but right now I really don't know. I don't think I have a favorite color, really, to be honest. I like neutral colors. I like colors that are easy on the eyes. I love the colors of nature. How does it feel scuba diving in the beach? I mean, you can't scuba dive anywhere else, so it's amazing to scuba dive on the beach. <laughs> you are so beautiful, Liza. I'm a big fan of yours. This is from Charmil Camillon. Thank you so much. Suso song, please. What's a Suso? Ah, Suso from Dolce Amor. <laughs> I don't even remember. Ang Suso. Oh, my phone's gonna die. Hi, Andy. Hola from Spain. How are you? Alam mo ng Korea agad kasi sa window. Actually, hmm. Diba? Pero may mga ganyang bintana din naman sa Pilipinas. Bebe's here! Hi, Bella! Hi, yeah, yeah. I'm pretty sure both of you guys are watching. I miss you. Wait, I said last five questions. It's 9.25. Okay, I'll do this till 9.30. And then I'm gonna go. For real, for real. Hi, Senora from Brazil. Hello, Kendril Ceballos. 
Thank you, Andy. You should come back here with me. We've never been to Korea together. I just realized. Oh, wait. Yeah, we've never been to Korea together. Lysangians. Oh my gosh, you watched the episode already? Yeah, so my first episode was with Won Jung Man, and um, he's the second most followed TikToker in Korea. Number one is BTS. Number two is Won Jung Man, and um, it was really, it was really fun filming that episode with him. He's just this ball of sunshine and energy, and um, he's a TikTok master, so I learned a lot from him, and yeah, it was just Pure fun and entertainment. Did you watch Thai series? This is from Daddy underscore Freen. I've actually never watched any Thai series. I don't think. Oh no, that's that's actually not true. So ABS CBN used to um, show some Thai shows. I remember there was one with Mario Moore. I forget the title of it, but I think I watched something of his. But I would love to start getting into watching Thai Thai shows. So please. Send some recommendations if you guys have any. Wow, there's so many people from Indonesia. Hello to all my Indonesian fans. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hazufel Bionazambra at the advance. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. I hope you enjoy your special day. I love you. Hi, Barbie. Hi, Barbie. <laughs> Hello, Ate Liza. Can you notice me, Bo? Hello. Hello, hello. I am from the UK and at work. This is from M. Choka. Hello from the UK. Thank you so much for watching me, but I think you should get back to work. You might get in trouble because of me. Liza Asim, Liza Asim, Liza Asim. What does that mean? Or is that Liza Asim? Like I'm sour? How do you know I'm sour? I might be salty or sweet or spicy. I think I'm spicy. I really like the song Spicy by CL. Hi, Michaela. Hello, hello. It's my birthday today. It's not my birthday today, sorry. I was literally just reading out loud. Hello, um, who, who said that? Oh no, I lost it. I need to greet you. Where is it? Where is it? Sig, Sigwi, happy birthday. Okay, so I think, oh, someone said, hey, hey Melissa said come to Dallas. I would love to. I would love to go back to Dallas. I really would. Aguelostels.25, are you still eating chili? Yes, of course, I can't. I can't survive with a lot, without a little bit of spice in my life. Okay, I think I can say bye now. I mean, I said I would be here till 9.30, but I'm not getting a lot of questions anymore. So, okay, fine. I'll say hi to some of the ones that are asking for shout outs. Gab underscore yell, hello. Speak Korean. Um, 사랑해. I love you so much from Saudi Arabia. This is from I'll stay underscore SKZ. Thank you so much. I love you too. And I hope to come back to Saudi Arabia one day. Oh wait, I don't think I've ever been. Sorry, I've never been to Saudi Arabia. Um, fave OPM song, fave OPM song, fave OPM song. <laughs> Thank you for that question, Jaya underscore me. Um, I'm trying to think. Does James, James Reed songs count as an OPM song? I mean, it is Filipino music. Um, I love James's album. I love all of his songs on that album. So I choose that. Or actually there's an amazing artist under um, Careless named Jolianne and she has a song called Sweet Memories and I absolutely adore her and her voice. She has the voice of an angel. She has the best voice ever. So really love Jolianne. Please check her out on Spotify. Her voice sounds like butter, on warm toast. 
Okay, it's 9.30. I'm gonna go for real now. Thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to watch Liza in Korea on the Puhaha channel. It is posted on my IG stories with the link and everything there. So yeah, please check that out. I love you guys so much. Thank you. Bye for now and hopefully I can do this more often.